This is the Black Stars Diary, Qatar 2022. We're still here at the Black Stars camp, and guess what? Some visitors have come to, you know, say, are you cool to the Black Stars? They're not visitors, actually. There's one lady there, she's looking around. She's trying to get, you know, she, she's trying to get hold of the players, but... Nanama, what be there? Just say, we'll take you over. Now we introductions, now. How far? What by you saying? Yeah, Yabapa. Then I did luck in the bio. And we're here to support as usual. We're Ghanaians for Ghanaians. And for a crucial match like this, High Sense and Ghana, it's our responsibility to be positive. And you need to say, ne, you did luck in the Wini 3 2. We hope it continues, right? Yes. I just cannot wait for us to crush Uruguay, you know. Crush them. It's a revenge match, you know. <laughs> and that's why this guy, I'm looking for him. <laughs> He's around. <laughs> I, I know. I know. But, but uh, kudos to everybody. I mean, I just want to say congratulations. The, the, the players, they put up a marvelous performance. I mean, from where we sat, the last 10 minutes, though. Uh, <laughs> that was some crazy minutes. But we, we sailed through and we thank God that uh, I'm, I'm looking at the possibility of a semifinal, you know. Maybe. Ready? Oh, yeah. After just one win. Round 16, yeah. <laughs> but you didn't come alone. You came with Madame as well. Hello. Oh, oh, no, it was absolutely <laughs> stunning and beautiful. Uh -huh. One, two, three. Last one, no. Last one, no. Not why so agitated. She couldn't even sit. A two, two, no. I'm telling you, she had to get up to the VIP lounge. Then she would come. She would sneak to watch a kuye. Then she goes back. So it, it was really nerve-wracking, and especially when he gave the ten minutes. Uh, I don't tell her like, yeah. oh my god. My first time, women are saying ten minutes is too long. <laughs> too long. Yeah. It was so long uh, anyway, anyway. For a woman, ten minutes. It's it's long. And, and you know what is funny? We kept looking at our watch. We're like ten minutes. Not ten minutes. I said two hours. Then five minutes. Like we were practically kicking our feet as if we were on the pitch. And it was so funny how the ball kept. Um, like being in our zone the, and wouldn't the, move. The pressure in the last oh, minutes, that was nerve wracking. That uh, was. Today was our keeper. He was phenomenal. Oh, because, Ziggy. yeah, Ziggy did yeah. so well. Brilliant saves. Even though there was a lot of tension and you were expecting him to miss some of those ones. Yeah. I bow for him. He did uh, well. And I, I came to understand why Otuado will play Jordan today. Uh, the crosses and everything um, was point. really effective and um, yeah, point. now my heart is at rest. Before then it wasn't. <laughs> final, final words to Ghanaians. I want to yeah. get your thoughts on what they make of Qatar. Mm, sure. That's the first time I asked anybody when I've just met you first. So I'll start off with you. Mm. What do you make of, we had so many things, we don't, I don't even know where to start from, but what has been your impression of Qatar? Honestly, um, I think, <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's, it's beautiful, it's calm, very serene. But I think as Ghanaians, we love to have fun, we love to party. So we're not seeing that feel that should come with football. It's like you just get that ambience feel in the stadium and when you're really out, you're not seeing much. So yeah, it's, it's a little, but we, we'll get by, we'll get by. What about you, what do you mean? I, I'm gonna give it to them for the organization. I think it's really put together very well. Uh, I know money is involved, you know, the substations, the higher card and Everything, how they put it together, it's easy to get around, most definitely. They've made a lot of things also available, you know, the Uber system. Everything is running pretty much smoothly for me. In the train, this evening after the match, you, yeah, people from all walks of life singing, you know, yes, asking for the Ghana flags and stuff like that. That is also very welcoming. Generally, I think the Qatar people themselves, I haven't seen much of them. I see a lot of Kenyans, I see Bangladesh and Africans, Africans yeah, uh, you know, Indians, every, everybody here. Where are they? Where are the Qatar people? <laughs>